Welcome. This is an instructional video on how to register for an account in the Environmental Permit Information Management System, or ePIMS. First, locate the ePIMS login page by entering epims.wildlife.ca.gov or by using one of the links in the department's Lake and Streambed Alteration or Canvas Programs related web pages. Once you are on the login page, you'll notice the Click Here to Register button. Click here and it will bring you to the registration page. It is very important that you read all of the instructions while filling out this form. Please fill out all possible fields, ensuring all required fields have been filled out. Lastly, click the I am not a robot button to verify your submission and click Save Registration Information. After clicking Save Registration Information, you should receive an automated email from ePIMS that looks something like this. This email will inform you that the approval and denial process can take up to 72 hours to complete. It will also let you know that if you are approved, you will receive two separate emails from ePIMS. One will contain your user ID and the other will contain your temporary password. If you do not see either of these emails, please check your spam folder. When you are registering, you also want to keep in mind that you may be denied registration. This can happen if you already have an account with us or if the information provided does not match the user. If your registration is denied, please email the help desk at epimshelp at wildlife.ca.gov. If you experience issues with epims or have general epims related questions that you would like to ask, please feel free to reach out to us at the help desk at epimshelp at wildlife.ca.gov. Please contact the CDFW regional office where your project is located for specific questions regarding your project, including the status of your EPIM self-certification, notification, agreement, status report, or fees. For general questions about CDFW's role in cannabis permitting, please send an email to askcannabis at wildlife.ca.gov. For general questions about the Lake and Streambed Alteration Program, please send an email to lsa at wildlife.ca.gov.